I have a, 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 a videotape of Coltrane playing this, a video. Yeah. And so he plays the melody right at the beginning of his solo. He, it's just an E minor, right? Yeah. He says... <laughs> So he just spells it out. Yeah. Those three triads stacked on top of each other. Yeah. So you I asked Miles Davis, I said, man, how do you play it? You know, you got your eyes closed or open, all this beauti beautiful music comes out. He said, learn as many licks or cliches as you can and then scotch tape them together. That's more or less how you learn <laughs> to speak a language. So I, I, I convey all my students, you have to learn the language before you can speak the language. Oberlin has journeyman instructors. We are, uh, you know, hands-on traveling all around the world uh, and, have, and, and, and have been in this profession for many, many years. Like I said, I've been for 50 years, I think everybody else also. And so you get an eclectic a, a viewpoint of music. Yeah. <laughs> but if you, if you use. Yeah, 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 to yeah. come down on that G minor yeah. passage. Yeah. Because if you're doing it faster and you get hung up on that little lip slur, then you're yeah. upside down. The thing I like about teaching, it makes me reflect on things that I say uh, that I think I know. Sometimes, and I try to demonstrate, I say, oh, I guess I don't know. <laughs> so it makes me kind of tighten up my game also. Keeps me on my toes. And I, I just like being a medium of passing the baton from previous generations to the present tense. Because that's so important uh, in any field. If, if you don't pass the baton to the present generations, that particular art form will come become extinct, like the dinosaurs, you know. So it's just really a pleasure being a tool of carry on the tradition of music, uh, and not just jazz, but music in general. And uh, for me, music is the breath of life. Here you go. I'm showing this this excerpt. Beautiful.